So, while I was getting ready for this video, see, I always have a few cars off to the side. Some reviews or other videos I was planning to do, or was thinking about doing, or whatever. Like Ed Trunken, for example, from my review the other day. And just some other cars around that I've used for some videos. Like Chick Hicks and the uh, Off the Shelf video. And some other stuff, like the instructions and pamphlets from some stuff. And I was pushing a few cars to the side, including this Mater. Most of the other cars that I pushed to the side ended up fine. But Mater fell down, hit the floor, and bounced up onto this bookshelf. I'm not kidding. I wish I'd gotten it on camera. It was so crazy. Again, he, he fell off the shelf, hit the floor, and bounced onto the bookshelf. And there's not a dent on him. So weird. Anyway, guys, welcome back to yet another review and to yet another Way Back Wednesday. Today, we're going to be taking a look at Ham from the 2007 Supercharge line. He was released as a single and a few times in the years following. He really is pretty rare now. Of course, based off of Ham from Toy Story. So, yeah, let's get started with the review. I know that opening was a bit unrelated, but I really just had to share with you guys what just happened. So, yeah, he's a sort of tannish pink color, and of course, he's supposed to be a piggy bank on wheels so you can see since his eyes are just supposed to be two dots painted on he looks very different from other cars with he not having white behind the eyes but instead the same color as the rest of him he sort of has eyelids eyebrows right there it's really hard to tell I can't even tell if those are supposed to be eyelids eyebrows of course has a little, a little uh, pig nose and Sadly, there are dents all over the sky. He's got a big grin, and his tires are are really worn out, as you can see there, sadly. So yeah, he's of course squashed, but for a reason. This is how he's supposed to look. I do want to mention that his wheels look sort of like hooves on an animal, or they could also look like coins, if you look at it, uh, depending on how you look at it. And of course, just... His door detailing is painted on, and you do have the uh, slit here. And through that, you could actually see how hollow the inside of this car is. You could see right here the wheels, the wheel well for this wheel. You could see my finger now tapping the wheel. And no, sadly, actual coins don't fit in there. I've tried. No license plate, but I mean, I guess that's appropriate. Backlights on the other side is basically. The same, I do want to mention that he is a bit propped up, like this wheel's a bit higher than the other one. So yeah, and then there's the base, probably one of the most interesting car bases because he does have added detail. He has the little cork that a piggy bank would have. So yeah, pretty rare nowadays, and that's pretty much it. Anyway guys, thank you all so much for watching. Another Way Back Wednesday, of course, will be out next Wednesday. Forklift Friday out on Friday, and Mater Monday out on Monday. I'll see you guys next time. Bye now.